Okay, so I'm going to be using this Astro 1442 nut zert tool and I'm going to be using a quarter inch by 20 nut zert. I've already got two in right here and it works really well. What I'm doing is I'm putting this clamp, this is going to be my stake pocket for my canoe rack right there so anyway I need to dr drill two more holes right here which I've already um, pre-drilled and then I'm gonna put in use one of these nut zerts and I'll put one on I've already uh, lubricated my tool right here and right here and I've already put in the uh, quarter inch um, Dremel I think that's what they call it and I'm going to put the nut zert on at this time just screw that thing on oh I gotta open it up first Screw that thing on so that the threads are just a little bit farther than the nut zert. And I'll be just putting it in there. Now this one's going to be a little bit difficult here, but I should be able to get to it. So that's what I'm going to do. I got that set up. Now I gotta drill this hole. So I'm gonna drill this out. This is a uh, well, these nut zerts are like a quarter inch but the diameter of the nut zert itself is a little bit more than a, um, a quarter inch. So I'm using a, uh, let's see, what is this? This is like a, I don't know what this drill is, but this bit is, but it's the next size up from a quarter inch. And then I've got this, uh, where is it? I've got this tool right here to just widen the uh, hole, the diameter of the hole, until I can put my nut zert in and fit it in. Okay, I checked the size on this bit and it's uh, 5 16 So I'm gonna drill these holes now. Nut zert. So I'm going to put that in there. So there's that's what it looks like. Stick it in there. Squeeze that thing. You don't want to over torque it. Looks like you did it. Unscrew it. pretty tight and I'll put on my clamp just to see how this okay and then I use my ratchet so I can feel how how tight it is pretty good. Good enough for what I'm going to use it for. So, there you have it. That's uh, installing a nut shirt. And I got one more to go. And I'll get a close up here so you can see. Sorry. That's the finished product.
There's my other two. Okay, i am got one, two, three holes already drilled. I got my fourth one to drill yet. And got my quarter inch by 20 nut zert. I'm gonna put that on right now on my Astro 1442. All right, so that's ready to go. And I'm gonna drill this hole out. This is a 5 16 drill bit. Okay, and then I have I have this uh, tool right here that I use to auger out the rest of the hole. And I take another nut zert just to Okay, so I want to get that nice and snug in there, and it's not, so I'm going to offer this out a little bit more. Okay. I want to take my time and make sure that just a little bit more. Okay. All right, perfect. So that's that's good. So now I'm ready to, to use my Astro 1442 nut zerk tool. So I'm going to stick that in there. And just make sure that I don't squeeze too hard. All right, here we go. So I'm gonna put my put this in there and see how tight it is. And that's really good. So that's it. That's your installing your nut here. Now that took me probably probably five minutes each one in the back there I didn't have this tool it took me about an hour for each one to reach up underneath there with the nut so here's my bracket now the the bolts are all tight and that thing is really tight and my two by four so that's gonna be I gotta put some spacers back here so that my two by four goes through there. But right now that's that's it. Enjoy your nut dirt tool. So there's my stake pocket. The reason why I put another stake pocket here is because I wanted to keep this cover. And um, the tracks for the cover are covering my stake pocket, so I'm putting a stake pocket inside for my canoe rack. And uh, there it is, the final product, you know, with those nut zerts. And man, that's really, that really works good. So I got to put another bracket down here. And, uh, but that's it. Took me about an hour to put that in right there and, you know, and do all the measurement, but looks pretty good.